A question people are wondering what's going to get uh, you know the, the question that a lot of people have right now is uh, what's going to get uh, uh, Lamar motivated what's going to kickstart your game you know just like uh, last uh, postseason you kind of woke up at one point <laughs> uh, <it> up. <laughs> yeah I mean the game will come to me I'll find it just have to be patient is there something that specifically that you're looking for in terms of Matchups uh, in terms of um, you know. I'll how take you guys my time. I'll take my time, and offense will come to me. Not worry about it. Lamar, how, how tough are they to operate against, just because of their defensive quickness? Well, they're a great size, um, really athletic. But um, I, I think I will line up in our, you know, the skill level that we can, we can play at. We can combat all that by moving the ball, taking good shots. I mean, they're gonna get their hands on some. You know, that's just the way the game goes. If we take good shots, we'll be all right. Did you think surprised you at all during the postseason? Or did you know uh, that they were going to be that pesky and that you know, They're the youngest team in the NBA. Yeah. So, you know, we expect them to play above the rim and play quick and so on and so on and run on a break. And if we take care of the ball and take good shots, then we'll be all right. Phil was talking about uh, his hope that you'd be more of an imprint, uh, I guess, the next game. Mm -hmm. What kind of imprint do you want to win? I just want to get myself going, you know, offensively. Find my shot, play my rhythm, stay in my space, my comfort zone. Were you surprised to see uh, Joe Bryant at the game yesterday? Did, did Kobe bring it up at all? Did he mention if it had any impact uh, on him? You know how we I felt mean, in the no. motion. I, you know, it's good to see him. Yeah. Are you used to it at this point in your career? People, you know, after uh, a game, off game, or one that doesn't look right statistically, come to you and asking you these sorts of questions. It's two games. You know, you play 82 games in the U.S. sometimes. You might have two bad games offensively, back to back. It's no big deal. You feel like defensively you probably were doing a good I mean, I'm out there. You know, um, still play basketball. It's still a big deal. Nothing. We won. You know, if I was a go-to man and, you know, I had seven and four points and we lost, then it would be like something to talk about. It feel called you out, though. It always does. You know, we got another game to play. You know what I mean? No big deal to me. Another basketball game. <laughs> he didn't call your name, though. He just said, we want to see you play a game the game. Yeah. We talked about that when you were over there. <laughs> Beachy's always late to the party. Yeah, it's all good. <laughs> What's that mean to you when he's an imprint on the game? I mean, you want to see me play well offensively. You know, you want to see me get involved. You got so many options. I guess so. We have the accent. Would you accent? I don't what know. does that mean? Exactly. <laughs> Ask me. You just want to see me go. Get my comfort zone. <laughs>